I don't even know why we're doing this. It's not a duet. Hi. Daisy Jones. Billy Dunn. I like your song. let somebody down, right? And now you're you're saying, you know, everything's fine. Look at us now, everything's in the past. It, nothing. Yeah, it what's wrong with that? I don't believe it. And it doesn't sound honest and it sounds simple. And I don't know you very well. You don't seem simple to me. Oh, thank you. She sounds like she's ruining the great song I wrote, Teddy. No, no, Billy, you wrote a good song. Not a great one. She's right, man. Your version is, uh, it is simple. You're holding back, man. And I get it. I mean, if I was you, I wouldn't want to be going to those places either. Look, if, if the label loved the song, why is They didn't. What do, you, what do you mean? The label said no. They don't know we're here. We'll try your version and then we'll get the original, all right? We don't need to argue. I was just gonna say that I love the sound of your voice. Okay, folks, this is Honeycomb, take three. Come to think of it, we never did do my version. You're a real asshole, aren't you? What? Singing your song. I gave you credit. You didn't give me those were my words you were singing. Do you know what? Have a nice life. I don't know, man. There's just there's just something about the two of you together. She said she wrote the whole damn song. Well, she did write the bit that everyone sings along to. I'm not saying she's untalented. I'm just saying... I'm saying she's a powder keg. I'm saying... What? What I'm saying is... I don't think we'd survive her. I guess I owe you an apology. I guess. I said some things after the festival and... And I'm sorry about that. Anyway... Uh, thank you for playing with us. The crowd seemed to love it, so... You're welcome. I just want to say a few things before we get started. First off, we have a new member of the band. So, let's hear it for Daisy Jones. Yeah. Welcome. Thank you for being here and for doing this with us. Thank you for having me. Are these even lyrics? Yes, they're lyrics or they're, they're ideas, they're fragments, they're just things off the top of my head. Kites fly in a It's a metaphor. Storm. For what? It's it, for feeling untethered or uh, adrift. Maybe just say that then. You know, it's okay sometimes to just say what you mean. I can say what I mean. Can you? Yes, I can. I think you're a head. How's that? Uh, it's better, actually. I can see us wiggling in the distance Like a mirage on sand that could be us trading secrets no one's could understand. I love that. I got you under my skin now. Why do you make it so hard? That sounds like a song. Don't leave me broke. Don't, don't leave me broke. broken and free. Won't you tell me where you are? You write songs about who you wish you were, not who you are. What if you didn't do that? What if you wrote songs about the guy that's not so good all the time, and the guy that lets people down, and the guy that maybe wants things that he shouldn't? Who'd want to hear a song about that? I would. I think everybody would. Someone sure did a number on you, didn't they? What does that mean? What? I was wrong about you, that's all. I never would have thought you were so... What? Like, broken.
we're more alike than I thought. How's that? My dad also left without a forwarding address. I was eight. I try not to think about him too much, but uh, I'm pretty sure everything I do is to try and make him regret it. Daisy! Why are you doing this? This is what we do. We push each other to be better. What did you say to her? What do you mean? I mean, the voice on the album. How'd you get her to sing like that? How much have you taken? I've heard her do it perfectly in control. Of my faculties. You're a mess right now. You know that? Tell me that there's nothing going on between us. Tell me that this thing, that the way I feel that this is in my head, and I'll go in there and sing the song, and we can all go home and never talk about this again. Tell me if I'm crazy. I still need a drink for all the glasses in the sink. From chasing a shot that ran through hell. For the record, I'm fine with what left of was mine. I almost took you by mistake for someone else. And uh, what was the name of that recovery clinic? Who told you about that? Sorry, Daisy mentioned something about that first tour, you needing to dry out and whatnot. I, uh, I mean, whatever. It happens, right? Drugs, women, you're a rock star. What are you gonna do? I mean, they don't all miss their daughter's christening because they're too coked out to show up. Yeah, it's not true. Tell him. You said it was all about the music. This is about That's the music. That's why you kissed me, so I'd get back on the mic. Listen to the song. I'd say it was worth it, wouldn't you? <sighs> You're a liar. We used to fight like that. Look, I don't need to know everything, but um, if you love her... I don't. Well, if you ever do, that is when this ends. Do you understand? Tell me about this. I didn't realize you were this famous. I'm not going back. You have to. I can't. You have a number one single. You have an I don't that. care. Go I don't there. care about oh any of it. Yes, you do. You're just too scared. Maybe you should go back. I want to go back. I just, I can't get hurt again. It won't be the same this time. I don't know if you heard, but I'm married now, so I'd like a suite for all these overnights. Well, I'm married too. Your wife's not coming on tour. Not the whole time, but I'm sorry. If she gets a suite, I get a suite too. On a separate floor. Oh, even better. Well, I get separate buses while you're at it. Is that, that possible? Seemed like a good idea at the time. You have one album. This is the kind of you ask for when your Crosby steals and Nash, okay? You sure you don't want to come? Oh, yeah, it'd be so fun with a two and a half girl. I'm gonna miss you. Miss you. You're late. Hey, man. Get this show on the road. Okay. Go be a rock star. All right.
together. We didn't have to like each other. And we didn't. What am I lying about now? Your whole life is a lie. I mean, you hear the shit that comes out of your mouth, man? Like, did you hear yourself back there? I know you. And you know I do. And that's what scares you, huh? You think I'm full? I do. You think I'm full? I do. Me, huh? Yeah? What about you, huh? What about you and Nikki? What about it? Well, you want me to believe that that's real? That you're happy? That you're in love? I am happy! And I am in love! Oh, come on. I know you too, Daisy. Daisy? 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 Rod! She's not breathing, man! Daisy? All right, all right, all right. It's okay. Love you. I need to get a message for me. Dr. Jacoby on Trinity Road. Sold out We should crowds. be together. I shouldn't have said that. No. Okay. No, I'm gonna go pack. No, no, no Daisy. I want that too. But, uh, she's my wife. I'm never gonna leave her. Daisy. Hello. Rod Reyes has a toothache in room 1205. Come on. What are you doing? Sorry, I... I can't be here, so... Um, I'll... I'm sorry. Feel whatever it is we feel the highs, the lows, it's its all part of it. We, we write 10 more albums, we, I mean, just. Think, think about what we could do, you and me. Isn't this enough? Rod called the doctor and he, he got the drugs out of your system. We left, I, I didn't think you'd want me there and you woke up. And where was he the whole time? Pack it up! Daisy, Daisy wouldn't listen, okay? I didn't know what to do. Daisy, we don't have to fight it anymore. Right, you and me, we're broken. Let's just be broken together. Let's just be broken together. Right? Let's be broken. Stop. Let's just be together. Stop. I don't want to be broken. I can't let you. If you knew how many times a day I sit and think about setting my life on fire, our lives. I have loved you since I was 18 years old. You think I don't see every side of you? We have had such a wonderful marriage. Your father and I. We chose each other. 
But nothing in life is ever as simple as we want it to be. So one day, when he's ready, tell your father to give Daisy Jones a call. They were miss a school play or a soccer game. See you become the amazing, amazing woman you've become. And then when your mother got sick, I, uh, I'm sorry. But at the very least, those two still owe me a song. <laughs>